In the latest episode of Running Man, viewers were treated to endless laughs and surprises as the cast members, alongside special guests Hong Kyung, No Yunsa, and Kim Min Ju, took on a series of unpredictable and hilarious missions. The theme of this episode, centered around the Trust Me race, required each participant to carefully balance team loyalty with individual strategy, all while keeping a stone-cold poker face. The day's challenges revolved around a unique numbers game where each player drew a number between 0 and 9 to create their own score. Teams had to combine their numbers to form the highest possible value, but there was a catch, the person with the highest individual number would be at risk for a penalty. This twist created tension and excitement as everyone faced difficult decisions, would they sacrifice their own safety for the team, or play to save themselves. As the competition progressed, several missions gave players the chance to swap numbers and teammates, adding layers of strategy and unexpected alliances to the game. One of the standout moments came with the mission dubbed Head Shooter Operation, where each participant sported a bald wig with a secret phrase written on top. The goal was to read the opposing team's phrase first, but seeing the cast in bald wigs alone had everyone laughing, and the sight of Yu Jae Suk and Ji Suk Jin embracing their ugly mode set the tone for comedic chaos. Guests Hong Kyung, No Yunsa, and Kim Min Ju also joined in, with their stunning visuals amusingly transformed by the wigs into a kind of mosaic that added to the humor. The interactions between the regular members and the guests brought fresh energy to the episode. Although No Yunsa had previously appeared on Running Man, her relaxed and bright demeanor was a stark contrast to the visibly nervous Hong Kyung, who was making his debut on a terrestrial TV variety show. Kim Jong Kook stepped in as a mentor, sharing tips with Hong Kyung and encouraging him to pour his heart into the show, leading to even more funny moments as Hong Kyung tried to shake off his nervousness. Another challenge involved rapid fire drawing, where each participant was given 30 words to sketch within a short time, after which their teammates had to guess the words based on the drawings. This mission quickly became a fan favorite as participants struggled to keep up with the pace, leading to a series of amusing abstract art pieces. No Yunsa, who had initially seemed confident with her art background, soon found herself overwhelmed by the speed, resulting in hilariously unrecognizable drawings that sent the cast and crew into fits of laughter. Meanwhile, Hong Kyung's meticulous attention to detail backfired as he lost valuable time, focusing on minor details instead of completing his sketches, causing the team to miss out on critical points. The ever-competitive Kim Jong-kook, known for his artistic flair on the show, didn't hold back. He raised his voice in an effort to claim the guessing rights for each sketch, transforming the studio into a decibel battleground as the cast energetically vied for the correct answers. Even the calm and collected No Yunsa found herself swept up in the lively atmosphere, her competitive side emerging as she tried to help her teammates guess correctly. Beyond the individual missions, the show captured several heartfelt and humorous moments of guest adaptation to the variety setting. No Yunsa, for instance, previously chose to appear on Running Man over attending her own graduation, underscoring her dedication to making her mark in variety television. Though this was only her second appearance, she brought a lively charm to the set. Meanwhile, Hong Kyung's rookie jitters were a source of both amusement and sympathy for viewers, especially as he struggled to match the fast-paced banter and comedic timing of the regular members. As the episode neared its climax, the final poker face race had each team strategizing carefully, debating who should take the risk of drawing high numbers and potentially face penalties. The trust me concept kept everyone on edge, with each participant trying to mask their intentions while convincing teammates to join them in making the ultimate high-stakes play. Ultimately, the combination of hilarious bald wig disguises, unpredictable drawing challenges, and tense decision-making moments left fans eagerly awaiting the next episode to see how these friendships and rivalries will play out in the long run. For all the laughs, unexpected twists, and friendly betrayals, this episode of Running Man proved to be a memorable one, showcasing the show's knack for pushing its members and guests to their comedic and strategic limits. Don't when it comes to iconic friendships in K-pop, one of the most cherished and surprising groups is the trio of Twice's Zuyu, G Idol Shuwa, and former CLC member Elki. Despite the different career paths they've taken, the three idols share an enduring friendship that has resonated with fans. This close bond became the center of attention recently when they celebrated Elki's birthday, creating a moment so genuine and affectionate that it quickly went viral. A shared kiss on the lips. On November 7, Elki shared a series of photos and clips on Instagram, giving fans an inside look at her birthday celebration with Zuyu and Shuwa. The posts showed an intimate gathering filled with laughter, heartfelt moments, and affectionate gestures, all of which made it clear just how strong their friendship truly is. Dressed casually and looking relaxed, Zuyu, Shuwa, and Elki appeared completely at ease with one another, and their natural chemistry was undeniable. The photos captured a progression of moments, from smiling group shots to playful embraces, that showcased the deep bond they share. Initially, 
Elki posted sweet images of Zuyu and Shuwa kissing her on each cheek, capturing a warm and tender moment between friends. But it was a short video clip that truly captured fans' attention and set social media abuzz. In the clip, Zuyu, Shuwa, and Elki shared a quick but spontaneous kiss on the lips, something both surprising and heartwarming to fans who are used to seeing their idols maintain a certain level of decorum in public. This display of genuine affection and camaraderie made the video go viral almost instantly, with thousands of fans celebrating the trio's openness and closeness. The reaction was swift, with netizens around the world praising the display as a beautiful testament to friendship that transcends the usual boundaries idol culture might impose. As the clip circulated, fans poured their admiration into comments across platforms, applauding the trio's willingness to share such a sincere moment with the public. Many highlighted how rare it is to see such authentic connections among idols, especially those from different groups and companies. Given the often competitive and heavily scheduled world of K-pop, fans found it refreshing to see Zuyu, Shuwa, and Elki express their bond so freely, noting how this moment reminded everyone that, beyond their public personas, these idols hold on to meaningful, genuine friendships. This isn't the first time the trio has shown off their closeness. Zuyu, Shuwa, and Elki have often been seen together over the years, whether on outings, at mutual events, or supporting each other's projects. Their history together has led to a unique and cherished friendship, one that fans love to follow. This latest interaction on Elki's birthday only solidified their bond in the eyes of their supporters, adding a new layer to the endearing friendship they've displayed over time. The kiss may be a simple moment, but for fans, it holds a special significance as it reflects the authenticity that can sometimes be missing in the highly polished and competitive world of K-pop. By showing this moment of closeness, the trio reminded fans of the human side of their idols, the part that values friendship, loyalty, and shared experiences above all else. Fans see moments like these as rare glimpses into the genuine lives of their favorite stars, adding depth to the admiration they hold. This unexpected kiss quickly became iconic for fans, who see it as part of the trio's growing legacy of friendship, a legacy that they can share with fans who feel more connected to them because of moments like this. This birthday celebration, and the kiss that defined it, is likely to be remembered as one of the defining moments of their friendship for years to come, reinforcing the special place they hold in each other's lives and in the hearts of their supporters. Make sure Actress Han so he took the spotlight in Seoul on November 8 at a Boucheron event held at AP again where she stunned audiences and fans alike with an ensemble that exuded both sophistication and allure. Known for her exquisite style and modern elegance, Han so he proved yet again why she's one of the most celebrated fashion icons in Korea today. Dressed in a flowing white gown that combined timeless grace with a touch of boldness, she showcased a look that was both angelic and daring, leaving netizens completely mesmerized. Her choice of attire, a floor-length gown adorned with intricate embellishments, sparkled under the lights, creating a mesmerizing, almost ethereal presence. While the gown itself was a work of art, it was the plunging V-neckline that truly captured everyone's attention. Tastefully supported by an illusion fabric that ensured comfort and coverage without detracting from the gown's silhouette, the neckline added a subtle yet powerful element of seductiveness. Han so he pulled off the look with poise, balancing sensuality and elegance in a way that only she could. As she posed for the cameras, Han so he shifted effortlessly between soft, delicate expressions and confident, model-like stances, bringing an undeniable charm and sophistication to every frame. Her demeanor was relaxed yet poised, her expressions shifting from graceful to playful with an ease that hinted at her versatility and comfort in the spotlight. Fans who gathered around captured her transformation into what many described as a living angel, with her gown and styling perfectly complementing her glowing skin and natural beauty. The simplicity of her makeup and minimalistic jewelry added to the ensemble's overall charm, allowing the gown's intricate details and Han Soe's natural beauty to take center stage. With her hair elegantly styled to frame her face, the look had an almost regal quality that enchanted her fans, setting social media abuzz. Shortly after the event, online communities lit up with fans and fashion enthusiasts alike commenting on her breathtaking appearance, applauding her for choosing such a striking yet refined gown. Many were quick to note her knack for elevating daring fashion choices with class, describing her look as a blend of modern-day princess with a subtle edge. Han Soe's effortless style has captivated fans over the years, and this look has only added to her legacy as one of K-fashion's best. Each public appearance is another opportunity for her to showcase her unique aesthetic, consistently setting her apart in the industry as a trendsetter who's unafraid to experiment while keeping her looks polished and sophisticated. Her presence at the Boucheron event only reinforced her role as a muse for both fans and designers, further establishing her reputation as an influencer who not only embodies fashion-forward choices but also redefines elegance with every look. Her daring white gown and plunging neckline served as a reminder that sophistication can have a bit of edge, making her a style icon in every sense. 
From magazine covers to red carpet events, Han Sohi has demonstrated time and again that she knows how to make a statement, leaving fans eager for her next appearance and curious about how she will continue to push fashion boundaries. If you love following celebrity style moments and seeing how stars bring elegance and boldness together, be sure to like and subscribe. Stay tuned for more updates on Han Sohi and other icons who redefine fashion with unforgettable looks.